Lucy, the, the, the satellite applications catapult has been a key partner uh, with the UK Space Agency in, in implementing the, the SPIN internship programme. And you, you know, at the catapult, you've offered diverse internships to undergraduates from engineering through to marketing. Um, you know, why, why did the catapult want to get involved in the SPIN internship programme? And, you know, what value does it bring to the catapult? And what do you think it brings to the UK more generally? Oh, I, th I think it's very much two sides of an equation uh, when, when when you get a good internship program. And I, I do think the spin term program is, is a fantastic one. We get, you know, we get really brilliant applicants and um, and the organisations that get involved with spin terms really, really want to do it. So you've got that you've got that relationship where both sides of it are really keen for a good result. So so it's kind of guaranteed to be successful. I think from the catapult side, um, you know, our, our role in, in the space landscape in the UK is all about stimulating growth and stimulating success. And quite a lot of that is focused around helping businesses grow. But of course, in, if we want to grow the space industry in the UK successfully, then, then we need good, clever, knowledgeable people. And as you quite rightly pointed out, Anita, it doesn't have to be people who have all got physics, maths and chemistry A-levels. You know, actually what's better is if we've got lots of different people with different backgrounds, different experiences and, and different career paths. That's why I was very excited to hear Emma's doing geography. If we think about the way planetary science is going, I think there's going to be some fantastic opportunities opening up it for jobs in the future that that you know, we, we don't really know what they are quite yet, but, but they will be and they'll, they'll surely be part of Emma's, Emma's career opportunities. And I, I think you know, when we look at, say, a marketing role or a business support role, or with Megan and textiles and, and art and creativity, you know, bringing in all the different aspects of creative thinking into the space industry are, are really what we need to do. Because at the moment, we're a sort of standalone sector, but the way that space is going, we're going to underpin an enormous amount of infrastructure and, and just general behavior. A bit like having a computer, you know, it's, it's, not, it's not a separate sector anymore, IT. It, it underpins everything we do. And, and to be successful like that, we need to have lots and lots of different thought processes going on and lots of different backgrounds involved.